Kia ora whanau and welcome to another episode of Get a Job and Get Healthy with Costas Enterprises. I am your host Alex Costas and as you can see from the title, um, yeah, I decided that now I have the ability to monetize this podcast. So I thought I would talk to you a little bit about that and what that means for you, the listener. Um, And, you know, I, I am just trialing this at the moment. Um, but I thought we'd go into what this could potentially lead and, you know, how much it costs and all that sort of fun fun stuff. Um, first off, we'll get through all the, the, the fun stuff as usual. Uh, if you want to, you can find me on Twitter or Instagram at the Kiwi Don. Uh, you can also find me in the MetaMask uh, NFT Discord, which is in my show notes, as the same thing, at the Kiwi Don. And feel free to hit me up anytime on any one of those platforms. You can also uh, email me at Don Costas, that D O N for Nike, C O S T A S, at gmail.com. Uh, you can also find me on www.costasenterprise.business.blog uh, for my personal uh, website. Okay, so now all the fun stuff's out. Um, I talked a couple of months ago about the potential about monetizing my podcast, and at that time, I was unable to do so. Um, As you guys know, I am currently uh, driving. Um, Again, I know, I know, last week was a bit of a shocker, Uh, no driving for once, Uh, but I kind of wanted to talk about this stuff on my way home and just discuss it with you guys. So I am trialing this. Um, I, I realise that my reach is not as big as other people's podcasts, <coughs> Joe Rogan. Um, uh, so I thought what I would do is just trial it, see if people are keen for it. Um, now at the moment, my podcast is still primarily free. And what I mean by that is most of my episodes, you do not need a prescription, uh, sorry, a, a subscription to listen to. Um, I have, I'm getting close to sort of, you know, the 100 podcast episodes, Um, but what I have done is some of my most popular podcasts, episodes that I've talked about previously, I have now turned those into the subscription. Um, So if you were one of the lucky ones that listened to these before, um, you won't be having to worry about that. Um, and you would have listened to the data and the stuff already. Uh, they are things like my Teespring episodes, which are the ones that get the most uh, listening uh, with the passive income, as well as uh, a couple of my Before You Start a Job and all that sort of stuff, which is all stuff that is available on my WordPress. So if you do want to listen to those at the moment, you would have to pay the $0.99 cents subscription per month Uh, to listen to those episodes. Um, I don't know if it's a recurring subscription. I think it's just a one month off. You can have recurring ones. Um, So at the moment, yes, I set set the price as 99 cents. I know there are higher ones. And the reason I set it as that is I honestly don't know what I'm doing with this subscription at this stage. I am hoping to build onto it. Uh, Hopefully going to start creating sort of uh, two episodes a week. Um, one episode will be what I'm doing now, um, which will be giving you updates and stuff. And then one episode will be more dedicated for the people that are subscription listeners. Um, and it will be focused probably more on uh, things like the Teespring, the getting a job, those particular things. Um, bear in mind that I don't really use Teespring so much, so it does involve me going deeper into uh, that sort of print-on-demand stuff that I have sort of slacked off a bit. Um, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna lie. Um, I am more into the crypto space of of wanting to sort of invest, uh, as well as investing in stocks and shares. But I might have some of the stuff on on this uh, episodes um, that will be to do with that stuff as well. Um, ideally, though, I am trying to keep as much of my stuff free as possible. But you know, if you are a listener and you are a supporter. Um, and you haven't yet listened to a lot of those episodes, then please feel free to subscribe for a month, listen to the episodes. At the moment, I have kept it very, very small. There's only about 11 episodes uh, that I've made that you have to pay for, effectively. 
Um, and it's not 99 cents per episode. It is obviously 99 cents per month. Um, I, Of course, I've only just done that. I included in my link below, you will have my subscription link. Um, I, I ask that, you know, if you do decide to do that, please drop me an email. Um, let me know why you would be keen to be and what would you like to listen to what would you want as a subscription service I would like to think that when I start getting a few more subscribers um, or if I get any at all um, I would have a bit more of a regular discussion with them and hopefully access to their contact details and just try to basically build my brand and build my podcast into something that subscribers would also want to listen to as well like um, maybe we make a couple of ask Alex uh, questionnaires um, maybe I can you know take a couple of calls and discuss them uh, those scores and, and record them and put them into the actual podcast themselves if the subscribers wanted that um, I, I would love to know what people would be keen to tell uh, for content um, I, I have recently just heard from uh, one of my friends uh, who said look I listen to your podcast I didn't realize you were going through so much, um, and, you know, he was he was very receptive, and, and, yeah, it was really, really nice to sort of have that discussion with him, um, and I've had that, had that from some of my other friends that have also listened to the podcast and sort of said, bro, you know, if you need to talk, we're here, and all that sort of stuff, which, again, I appreciate every single moment of that, um, but this is more like bringing it out to you guys, like you guys are my Fano. I want to make sure that, you know, I am creating the content that my Fano wants to listen to. Um, yes, I ramble, yes, I put everything out there with a lot of stuff, um, but, you know, I'd love to know what you guys think about um, my content and, and how I could improve. Obviously, you know, not driving and recording normally would probably be a number one, um, but at this stage, I, I don't know, like, what, what interests my listeners. Um, I keep talking about, you know, I have this many thousands of listens and all things. At the moment, I'm assuming about 1,600 listeners, uh, listens, sorry, um, but about nine average people that listen every week. So, um, out of my nine people that do listen, reach out, email me, contact me, Twitter me, you know, or, or Instagram me or anything, like, like, I would love to know what you guys want to hear about. Like, do you like? Do you not like? I'm pretty open to feedback. Like, if you're like, bro, you need to, you need to structure your things more. You know what? I'm okay with that. I will, I will take that on board. Um, while this is my sort of way of talking, way of getting everything out on in the ether that is uh, the world. Uh, another thing that you got to remember as well is, you know, I wanted to be able to something that you guys can listen to and actually want to listen to like that's important to me um i want to know my audience and at the moment the only audience sort of figures i've got is that there's over 50 percent that listen from the u.s and um about 59 percent for the most part listen as are ma- males um and the age range is the other thing that i know a lot about like I don't hit it off with the 65ers and plus, you know, but hey, if you're one of the elderly people and you're, you're, you know, 65 and plus, tell me what I'm doing wrong. Let me know. Let me try to include you guys as well. Um, I've said before that you guys are my whanau. You guys are my family. Because of that, I want to treat my family right. You know, I want to give back to my family. I want to give you guys the content you want. So yeah, if you do, you know, want hit me up, contact me, let me know what would you, uh, even if you're not a subscriber, and as I said, I don't have any subscribers yet, so tell me what you would expect, you know, from 99 cents, would you expect a personal email, or a, um, a, 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 you know, what kind of podcast episodes would you prefer if you were a subscriber, what would entice you to make that leap, um, should I be doing certain things like uh, ads, you know, if, if the monetization subscri- uh, subscription doesn't work, like, should I be doing, you know, buy your cotton soft toilet rolls, you know, it's like, I really want to know about that sort of thing, because I do want to grow this, this is my, this is my, this is my baby, you know, 
I do this more than I do my my website. I'm not going to lie. Um, but I still want to create it for you guys as well. Like you know, and this it's all good me putting all my words out there and saying oh, I do this. I need to do this. But at the end of the day, you're the guys that listen to it. You know, and it means a lot that you do listen. I I say it enough. I can't be grateful enough. And and you know, I've talked about gratefulness before. And, my previous episodes and did a whole episode based on that and it is truth like you know I am grateful that you guys do want to listen I'm grateful that you you know are there to be my venting stations but at the same time like you don't want to just hear me vent all the time like tell me what's going on tell me what's what's going on with you and you know how are you dealing with the world can we discuss about it like you know I, I am available offline as well. Like I won't, if you don't want to bring anything to the table and on the podcast, hey, that's fine. That's fine. I'll find something else to talk about. I always do. But at the end of the day, like if I see a common trend from people talking to me about what they listen to, like I will start bringing that in. Um, what else is going on in my life? Just we, we've talked about the monetization stuff now and you know, realistically, as I said, 99 cents per month, uh, I think that's quite low uh, as an entry point, given that I don't know what I'm doing with this monetization, I am literally trying to find stuff out on my own, I still make this content for making this content, uh, rather than, like, you know, actually going, oh, well, I, you know, I want to make money on this, like, yes, it would be nice, it would be lovely to, to, make a few few dollars on this but at the end of the day like as I said before you guys are like my therapists without actually offering me advice Um, you guys listen to me you guys take on board what I talk about and so I I don't really want to like if I can take something from you guys and build it that's huge to me it's huge um and given that it's also my brand and it's my way of speaking and stuff like yeah that, that's great um, I don't really want to do things like ads if possible um, given that you know my audience is in for making their own money and I think in a way doing my own ads for products that I use which I'm not getting sponsored for you know or, or if I was getting sponsored for like would I believe in them like maybe maybe not you know I mean (laughs) let's let's be real Um, if someone like Coca-Cola were like Alex we want you to promote our our beverage I'd be like Coca-Cola's great drink it drink it good like you know because I used to drink a lot of Coca-Cola it was you know one of the things I used to collect Um, it would be the same if like you know uh, McDonald's were like do you want to promote our Big Mac I was like Big Macs are awesome eat them eat them good even though I'm the get a job and get healthy uh, podcast like you know a lot of my life has been centered around eating the bad foods and yeah like like if they were like would you sponsor us part of me would be like well yeah I, I know the food's good like you know I used to eat it you know <laughs> but um, ideally I don't want to be putting ads into this podcast if possible um, however it is another avenue as well um, I think the subscription could work um, especially when I start doing sort of one episode on one episode off um, or I do two episodes a week where subscribers are getting their own special episode um, I'm still you know maybe I do it bi-weekly maybe I do it weekly I, I honestly am at the point where I don't know um, I will look into it all like I'll probably try to do a special subscriber episode sometime this week um, uh, in the next coming week just so that I've got something there but then I, I, as I said with those ones I kind of want to structure them so that you know it, it matches why I'm promoting that subscription like at the moment the subscribing part is you want to learn about getting a job and um, you want to sort of expand your knowledge on Teespring like it, it's it, it's those sorts of things that I'm promoting at the moment because those are the most um, episodes that people have listened to um, so yeah, I'm, I, I don't know, I'm still 
thinking it out and, and, and I only organised it the other day um, and just put it on as a laugh for the first part um, because of the simple fact that I, you know, for ages I didn't even know I could do it in New Zealand. So I don't know if this has been a new change or it's happened in the last sort of month or two months. I know that a couple of months ago it still didn't have it, so I'm, I'm surprised to see that now I can. Um, but yeah, fingers crossed. Um, uh, I, I do want to stress though, if you are a listener of mine now, I am not asking you to get the subscription. I'm not going to be like, you should do it, just do it, because you're going to get extra, you're going to do this. I'm not that kind of guy. Um, if you want to do it, great. If you don't want to do it, great. Like it To me, I would love the support, but hell, just getting a simple email from you guys or a message or, you know, a, a, a DM or anything, that is huge as it is because I want to grow this and making that connection with that person is huge in itself. Um, I, as I said, like the monetization thing, it, it's a nice to have. Um, I would rather it, it be affected to new users, the ones that don't, like, you know, aren't my loyal followers. Um, yeah, I, I, as I said, I don't know how this is going to work. I don't know what I'm going to do with it, but we'll, we'll see how we go. As for what else has been going on, um, I still contact my partner every day. Um, uh, I haven't cried since the first day, but there's definitely been emotions uh, running high, and yeah, that, that's always been fun, um, as expected. Um, missing her like crazy. But at the same time, always understanding as to why she's doing what she's doing um, and completely and wholeheartedly support her in this instance. Um, as for things like, you know, tomorrow's my, my boss, it's her last day with us. Um, I got to admit, I am a bit emotional about that as well. Um, this is literally a woman that has quite easily I would say have has helped me change my life in the workspace um, like I came into the role that I'm doing now completely fresh had only had a, a, a basic understanding of what the job entailed um, but because I had a passion for the subject that I'm I was doing um, they, they they took me on and yeah like uh, she has literally helped shape me so much and helped and really supported me with all my stuff going on in my personal life. Um, I, I am going to miss her so much, um, but at the same time, like, completely wish her well. Um, like, she's going to a, a much better role, um, a much better job. Um, I know that she's going to miss us, just as like we're going to miss her. Um, so that's a bit a bit emotional, a uh, bit, bit sad, but as I said, still, it's kind of the same thing as my partner, like, it's sad, but it's happy, like, support, but still sad for me, um, what else is going on, uh, I bought another MetaMask, um, at a very low cost, uh, the guy that originally, uh, listed it, um, has listed it a couple of times, and, um, I it, it is a semi double of the mask that I've got but it's got a hood uh, this time which covers half the face which I haven't got a hood one before uh, it's got a symbol as well it's got a Bitcoin symbol so yeah it's quite funny um, and I've seen some of the animations on the background of some of these ones and really looking forward to it I can afford to, to get these animated um, I have said to people about MetaMasks and their passive income and what you should be doing if you are looking at getting one. Um, the reason why I picked up this extra mask uh, was exactly for that reason. It gets me closer to my goal. My goal at the moment is uh, a total of 10 or more MetaMasks um, because of the, the, the idea that they're doing. Um, if I have sort of 10 masks, then that will allow me to get one node uh, every week for four weeks 
Um, so, so basically, it's paid out monthly, um, but I will have enough to buy uh, one node every every week, uh, which is you know over they they pay you monthly, so that's four nodes. So yeah, if I do what I want to do, which is actually mint two at one time, then I get a free one uh, that will take me to that would take me to nine masks at this stage. Um, my intention is still to mint four, taking me to a total of, um, uh, well, at that time it would be 11 masks, but it'll actually be 12 masks. And if I had 12 masks, that means that I'd be basically be getting a free node every, uh, every six months. Um, and each node, of course, would be creating its own passive income and all that sort of things. I have been struggling with how I'm I'm planning on separating this stuff a bit. Um, I've already created some extra wallets and I need to add those to the system that we're using. Um, and I'm wondering whether or not I buy one node for each of them or whether when I get the money uh, from the MetaMasks based on the ones that I've got, whether I put those in their own... Um, wallet as well so basically splitting everything up um it is an idea um uh, because that way each one will start to recur their own um but what i'm actually thinking of doing is um letting the the, the wallet that has the metamask payments go into it um build those own, build their own ones until i have enough nodes if i can get to like 62 nodes that would have basically accrue me about 10 of this dollar, uh, 10 dollars or enough to buy one node a day. Um, when you get to 100 nodes, then basically you're earning roughly 85 dollars of this particular dollar a day, uh, which is more than enough to get like eight nodes a day. And then they just compound, compound, compound. Um, if I could get, yeah. If I can get to 60 nodes, um, I'm thinking cash out every day. When I cash out, build a node, cash out, build a node, cash out, build a node. Uh, maybe I wait a week and then get seven nodes and then just do the seven nodes or do eight nodes or 10 nodes. You know, or wait till I get basically, after 10 days, I can buy like, you know, 10 nodes. Um, I'm still looking at all that sort of stuff. So yeah, I, I think it's a really, it's going to be, so crazy when it kicks off um and i'm just trying to get ready for it um it does involve putting away a bit more money that i didn't want to um and and you know that that involves me doing things that i need to do um but yeah really looking forward to to seeing how that's all working um yeah i I think the plan is going forward it is trucking along and because I already have one of the nodes of the project that we're talking about um, within MetaMasks. As I said, until it's officially released, I don't want to say the name of the project. Um, But what I will say is it is uh, generating quite a nice little... um, uh, The the node itself generates about 17 cents a day, um, which is, you, you might think, oh, that's nothing. But I'm already at like a dollar eighty six. So I've had it for about a week, um, and yeah, I'm 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 enjoying it, and I can't wait until I can get some more nodes, and then just have them generate more and more and more. So if you get like you know one node generates me seventeen cents a day, a, a seventeen cents a day. Well, you know the more nodes I have, the better. So as I said, when I get to ten, uh, if I can get to ten nodes, that's that's generally only one. A dollar seventy of this particular coin every day, and then by that time in ten days, I have enough to buy sort of eleven nodes or twelve nodes, you know. So, yeah, I, I, I think the future is going to be quite a bright one, um, and um, I just want to be ready for it, basically. So, if you do have questions, hit me up. I, I would like to talk to you guys. As I said. Um, we'll make this quite a shortish episode about you know 25 or 26 minutes um as always thank you so much please contact me don costas at gmail at the kiwi don all that sort of stuff um 
monetization link will be in my in my show notes um if you want to subscribe contact me if you don't want to subscribe contact me regardless i want to hear from you um I, i'm not going to be like one of these guys like oh no i only speak to subscribers you know i don't run an only fans and if i did it would be a very scary only fans um but that said uh please be mindful that you know anything that you provide me any info is really really beneficial um and i will gladly sort of uh take that on board like whatever you guys provide me whatever you tell me um If you want to keep it anonymous, you can keep it anonymous. Um, If you want to tell me straight up, like, hey, look, I think this would be really cool for your podcast, tell me. Like, I am open to criticism. Like, I'm not one of these guys like, you can't tell me that. Fuck you. You know, like, no. If there's something wrong that I'm doing wrong, tell me. If there's something I'm doing right, tell me. Like, the more I can work on this, uh, the better experience I can give you guys as well. And at the end of the day, that is what I want. Like, you know, even though it's me rambling, at the end of the day, I still want you guys to enjoy the experience. So yeah, hit me up. um, Let me know what's going on. Um, As always, I love you guys. And as always, good luck. Have a great week, peoples.